My name is Katie Webb and I'm the principal at Paintsville Elementary. This is my sixth year as principal at our elementary school. We also have Mrs. Davis with us today. She's handing out the uh, handouts. Miss Davis is our sixth grade math teacher and Mrs. Blankenship, one of our kindergarten teachers. And we're here today to talk about our Activating Catalytic Transformation Project. This year we are focusing on a project called Full Steam Ahead. This is actually our second year in the ACT program. Last year, Jennifer Carroll came and spoke with us about the project and what all it entailed. Um, if your school's not involved in ACT yet, I heavily encourage you to do so. It's a great way to tackle a problem or an area that you want to improve at your school and they'll give you supports for that and most importantly, funding for that. And it lets you determine what you want to work on yourselves as a faculty. Last year in our first year with the ACT program, we had already done some work as a staff and determined that our area of need in our elementary was with our writing program. We had the opportunity to show growth there and help our students improve and show proficiency. So last year as part of the ACT work, we focused on writing. And last year, we focused on acquiring more resources for writing, professional development for our staff, and those things were paid for through the ACT program. We also had people on the KVEC staff like Jennifer Carroll and Carol Mullins come out and work with our staff. And like I said, I can't sing the praises of ACT enough for the resources and support that they give you. When we got into the work a little bit more, we realized it went deeper than that. Our students needed more work and more exposure and resources with critical thinking. And this year, as our continuing work in ACT, we've transformed our project and we're gonna focus on STEAM as a way to work with critical thinking skills with our students. So I'm gonna turn it over to Ms. Blankenship and Ms. Davis. Uh, my name is Pam Blankenship and this is my first year on the ACT team, which they are doing an excellent job and what we were talking about mrs webb met with each of our, the staff members individually this summer to talk about what we felt like we needed to go or what direction that we needed to go in to help our students performance improve and after gathering all that information and data we felt like that the steam program and we're going steam plus h to include health was an area that we thought that our students needed more focused in so that they would be career ready, college ready for all these new job opportunities. And we are focusing on ways to help them improve their critical thinking skills because our students are learning writing skills, but now they want to be able to apply these things and get it down to where that when we're taking those K prep tests at the end of the year that they can show what they know and think critically and solve those problems. So that leads us into Mrs. Davis. Um, so uh, like they said, we are focusing on the STEAM, but uh, the thing with ACT is that we look at what we are doing short term, what goals do we have as a faculty for our students and for ourselves in the short term, but also what do we have for our students and our faculty in the long term. Um, and long term, we all want our students to be college and career, college and or career ready by the time that they leave high school. Well, by the time they leave our elementary school, we look for them to have those strategies, the knowledge, the critical thinking ability that they can apply and start working on those college and career life skills. Um, then the short term impacts go straight into our testing and looking across the board at what we struggled in as um, a faculty, what we struggle in in carryover, and it all led back to that critical thinking, problem solving type strategies that they were doing this in math, but they weren't doing the same skill in science. And it was all because they couldn't problem solve and apply um, content from one subject matter to the other. So we're hoping that our short-term impacts are going to be more carryover of those critical thinking and common skills across the curriculum. We also, through the ACT program, were able to go and talk with our board and talk about our needs as a faculty and, and the needs of our students. They've supported us greatly in this work. They have granted us a one-year position for a STEAM teacher or STEM teacher. And our goal with that is to use that person to work directly with our students and also collaborate with our faculty, use the money from the ACT program to start acquiring resources for our work. So again, our focus is STEAM this year, full STEAM ahead. Thank you.